This question is very obviously testing punctuation, and so when that happens, we should be thinking about sentence structure. Where are there are breaks in the sentence? Why might we need to add or subtract pieces? And so another thing that's helpful is sometimes looking, if there's other punctuation in the sentence, that's gonna affect what's going on with the punctuation that we need to change. So in this case, what I hope you recognize is that this piece in the middle, George Surratt's Sunday afternoon on the island of La Grande Jatte, is just a long extra description of the work of art that we're talking about in the main sentence. And so to use the color green here, our main sentence is this. And actually I'll stop at the other comma because that other comma also is giving us an extra clause. So it's a slightly different extra clause, but it's another extra clause. And that's what commas do. They add on extra things to sentences. So in this case, the main sentence is, one such work of art is composed of millions of tiny dots of paint. That's a complete sentence, it could stand on its own. So if we're gonna insert this specific example in the middle of that sentence, we had better show that separation, show that break with punctuation. The first time we break away, we use a comma, so when we come back, we should also be using a comma, and that is why choice D is the answer. That is not the only way to break a sentence apart and insert something into the middle. We can also use parentheses. We see that probably pretty often in our own lives, but we can also use the dash. This is okay. It's just not okay in this case because we didn't start with a dash. So if it had started after the word art with a dash, then we would close that extra piece of information with the dash as well. And why would we use one over the other? Well, a lot of that is an author's choice, but when we see these things on the SAT, the author has already made the choice, so we are just finishing it for them. So that is why the comma is better in this case. We just have to go with what the author has already chosen.